boys and girls and in this video I will show you how to make the same organic geometry from Ducky 3D tutorial but with geometry node. Let's get started. Here we are in Blender with cube, regular cube. Move up our timeline here and switch it to the geometry node editor. Click on our cube and click new geometry node. For this geometry node setup we will need a volume cube first. Edit right here. You can delete group input for now. After the volume cube, we need to add the transform node. After the transform node, let's add volume to mesh. After that, let's add set shade smooth. We will need it for later to look our geometry delicious. This is our basic setup. Let's change the resolution of our volume cube to 90. Let's add the gradient texture. Choose the fax settings. Fax settings and move it to the density. Don't forget to switch this se setup to spherical. Alright. Let's add mass vector mass. Connect it to the arrow vector. Change the, change the vector mass to multiply. Not a multiply, add, sorry, just a multiply. Okay. Duplicate the multiply node. Let's add the position node. Move it up here. Move it all here. After that, let's add noise texture. Connected to the our second multiply node. Add wave texture. Connect the color to the vector. Add color ramp. Connect the color to the factor. Factor. Let's move it up here. Let Let's add mass node mass. Change it to subtract. Duplicate this node and change it to multiply add. Connect the color socket of the color ramp to the subtract. And connect this like this. Connect this value of multiply add to the vector number one of our second multiply node and connect two multiply nodes for between each other. Now we need to change some numbers. Here change all to one. We already got something interesting. Here Change this to 0.3, the detail for 0, roughness for 0, and distortion 1.5. On the wave texture, change the scale to 6 and other settings to 0. In the value of subtract, change to 0.3. Here in the multiply add math node, change this 0.1 and this to 1. And that's what we got so far. You can play with some settings like the scale of the nose texture and scale of the wave texture, also position of the your color ramp to get interesting results. Also, you can change some other numbers 
and play around by yourself. If you want to increase the density of your mesh, just increase it with the volume cube. This is the whole setup so far. You can look at this like full window. The interesting part of this geometry node is that you can export your mesh and do whatever you would like with it. Thanks for watching guys and see you later.